Hi everyone, welcome back. In today's video, I will be talking about probe manipulation when you are scanning blood vessels. If you are struggling with this maneuver, this video it will be perfect for you. So stay tuned till the end. Today I will be using this handheld device provided by Evamed Technology. It is two-sided probe, curve linear and linear probe in addition to cardiac preset. When we show the cardiac setting, it will give us on the screen this face array or sector image orientation. In addition to that, the device comes up with different modes. We have the color mode, power doubler, in addition to the pulse wave and B mode. In addition to that, we have wide range of depths, reach up to 300 millimeter. If you need to know more about this handheld device, you can check the link below in the description. Now I will explain to you these maneuvers over the carotid arteries, but for sure you can apply it for any blood visit. First, I will start with the sliding movement. By slide the prop from side to side, I will try to put the common carotid at the middle of the screen we have the desired blood vessel on the middle of the screen then I will slide from proximal to distal I will scan the whole way up until I'm over the carotid bulb after that it will bifurcate to internal and external Now I will do the same maneuver from distal to proximal. All you need to do just to slide the prop from side to side. And for me, this it will be the most easy maneuver. Now I will try to scan the carotid on the sagittal plane. And actually what I observe, many of us, they are struggling to follow the blood vessel on the sagittal plane. Now I will rotate the probe 90 degree till we are sagittal on the carotid artery. And also I need you to observe that when I rotate the probe, I do some tilting in order to get the whole length of the, of the blood vessel. Now I will follow it distal till we are over the bifurcation. Now I will follow it on the opposite direction while I'm tilting from side to side. In order to get the internal and external carotid, all I need to do is to angle the probe from side to side. Now I will try to follow it with the color mode. I put the color box and I will move from proximal to distal while I'm doing the same tilting. Here's some mistake we all keep doing that we keep our hand steady but you should tilt your hand little bit and you will have image like this. 
that is it for today. I hope you like it. For more information and details about uh, handheld device, you can visit the link below in the description. For more video, you can follow us on the following account.